goes, that was like two weeks ago. I don't know, I'm just saying Happy New Year. And he goes, whatever. <laughs> Shut up! It's just a date you can't with Can it not be a Happy New Year past a certain date? Right. Idiot. <laughs> you're watching, you're a moron. He goes, whatever. Shut up! <laughs> oh, Happy New Year, what? <laughs> That's my life. <laughs> Look at this. Hat crimes bill passes Senate committee. Well, thank God. Someone is doing something about these hat crimes. <laughs> I never heard of this cereal, extra value priced. Hooey and Oat Bran. <laughs> Hi and Oat Bran, I know. I don't think I'd enjoy the hooey. <laughs> Is the Holy Spirit Lutheran Church. All you can eat spaghetti dinner. <laughs> Includes metal ball, salad, <laughs> the jawbreakers. <laughs> Can't I always talk about stupid criminals? All right. This is a stupid victim, this moron. Bike stolen from porch. See that? Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm going to read it to you. Michigan police were called to the home, 200 black, blah, blah, blah. Victim told police a 26-inch uh, purple 10-speed bicycle had been secured to the porch with a chain and could not figure out how the bike had been removed since the chain and lock were still intact. <laughs> bike is gone. Chain and lock still there. Investigating officer found the three-digit combination tag attached to the bike lock. <laughs> Victim told police he kept the combination on the lock in case he forgot it. <laughs> Happy New Year! <laughs> I'm not familiar with this brand of bathroom tissue, Kleenex Continental Bath Tissue. Those don't look like they would. I don't know. I don't think I'd be comfortable using it. <laughs> what? Another idiot! Mom purportedly used way, uh, purported way of perfecting driving skills prompts police charge. A West, a West Bath Road resident was arrested on charge of child endangerment as she allegedly used her three juvenile daughters as traffic pylons while she practiced her driving skills. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Mora, Minnesota. This is a 36 intelligent brunette. D Y M. I guess that's divorced white male. That means five foot four, 180 pounds, non-smoker, straight, honest, and look, he's a Christian swinger. I didn't know you could do that. I'm not sure how that works. Oh, that sounds like fun. <laughs> A conservation camp inmate reported seeing a female passenger in a truck with duct tape over her face gyrating while the vehicle was passing through Old Station traveling towards Four Corners Friday afternoon. The uh, Eureka Highway Patrol stopped the vehicle and found the female and placed the duct tape over her mouth so she wouldn't eat. <laughs> she's trying to diet, so she's going down the highway. <laughs> Happy New Year. <laughs> well. Happy birthday to the most impotent person in the family. <laughs> you know, I tell you, when you're a police officer, the worst thing is domestic disputes. People are just crazy. Look at this. Uh, man, uh, animal issues. This is a police blotter. Man drinking liquor in front of an adopted bird. The man's live-in ex-wife called police because he was drinking liquor in front of their bird, which she said he's forbidden to do because it makes their dog mad. <laughs> How crazy are these people? His live-in ex-wife. <laughs> Stop drinking, you're making the dog serious. <laughs> Idiots. You can win a $10,000 shopping spree. If you can identify this Hamilton landmark. Hmm. I'm a little stumped. <laughs> Here's a genius for you, Kim. What's that? Man's attempt to rob drive through window with a knife fails. An employee at the Taco Bell was working the window when the man pulled out an older model yellow pickup. He showed her knife, asked for the money. She shut and locked the window. <laughs> Boy. <laughs> 
Oh, this is okay. This is what happens when you take a picture of a man who's reading a book, okay? And you don't look at the picture after you take it, okay? The man is reading a book, 